I'm John Carlin and this is your 10 News Update. The case against the AWOL Marine accused of killing his mother's live-in boyfriend, sparking a massive manhunt, will now go before a grand jury. Michael Brown appeared in court in Franklin County for a preliminary hearing Wednesday. According to a submitted autopsy report, Rodney Brown was shot six to eight times. Brown's mother also took the stand to describe what happened the night of the murder, testifying that her son put a gun to her head. The defense questioned her credibility, however, based on a history of mental health issues and also argued that charges should be downgraded to voluntary manslaughter. Roanoke's mayor is not so sure the city is ready for phase three of reopening next week. We are told that he's concerned about the rising number of cases, especially the influx of people diagnosed after visiting Myrtle Beach. According to VDH, there are now 46 cases. That's an increase of 27 in just 24 hours. Anyone who goes to the beach is asked to self-quarantine for two weeks when they get back. Bush Gardens Williamsburg likely will not open for at least another month. The president says he's frustrated that their large outdoor facility is being grouped in with businesses like bowling alleys and skating rinks. Staff at King's Dominion have expressed a similar frustration. Lawmakers are reaching out to the governor's office to see if they could make changes to the guidelines. A reminder that updates are at WSLS.com and the 10 News app. I'm John Carlin, 10 News working for you.